The first photo in the color nature section is called Natal Spurfowl. It got 12, which is gold for a four star worker. Well done, Dix Miller. The focus is good, with the fowl in focus and the background nicely out of focus. The photo seems oversaturated and there's a strong yellow cast. Flying down got 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Karen Crook. Good action was captured and the composition is good. It feels as if the focus is not 100% on the spoonbill. Son Koliki got 10, it is silver for a 5 star worker. Well seen and the focus is good, but unfortunately the photo does not have much impact and it's very busy with no definite focal point. Kolgans got 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Himan Meyer. The focus is excellent. The Egyptian goose is perfectly in focus while the background is out of focus enough to make the bird stand out. I like the frozen action and the water drops at the bird's feet. The light seems a bit bright though. Lilac breasted roller got 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Johan Meiberg. The roller is well in focus and I like that the shadows are not too dark. I think the photo was taken at a very difficult time of day, so maybe push up the saturation to give it more impact. Paradise fly catcher with catch got 12, it's gold for a 4 star worker, well done Arthur Estmond. It is a strong story that was captured and the photo has a lot of impact. The large moth adds to the impact. The focus is perfect, but the only negative is the bright background. Curious got 9, it's gold for a 1 star worker, well done Simone Els. It is quite an interesting photo of the white crested helmet shrike. The eye of the shrike is in focus, but most of the bird is unfortunately out of focus and brought the point down. The surrounds are also very busy and distracts the viewer's eye from the bird. Mudface got 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Tom Farmer. It is an interesting photo of the wildebeest covered in red mud. The focus is excellent, but a tighter crop might even make the photo stronger. Panu Blader River Canyon got 12, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Rian Swanapool. It is a beautiful and impactful photo of the canyon with lovely colors and saturation. I like the composition and the soft light, well done Rian. Croc Delight got 11, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Gerard Geldenhuis. Good action was captured and I like the frozen action that was captured. The light just seems a bit flat, maybe increase the contrast. Close got 11, it's gold for a 1 star worker, well done Gerard Lowe. The focus and light is very good and lots of detail is visible. The crop is just too tight and uneasy. You amputated the whiskers of the leopard and it will make the photo stronger if you allow more space in front for the leopard to look into. Dragonfly got 12, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Margaret Finn. It is a well captured close up of the dragonfly. The focus is very good with everything around its eye that is in focus. It doesn't bother me that the wings are out of focus. There are some areas around the wings that look as if selective editing was done. Leopard got 10, it's gold for a 4 star worker, well done Dix Miller. The focus is good and there's a lot of detail captured. The light seems a bit flat and you can allow a bit more space in front of the leopard to look into. It would have had much more impact if the leopard looked at the viewer. To the bone got 12, it's gold for a 5 star worker, well done Karen Crook. It is a photo with a lot of impact. The focus is excellent and I like the light in the vulture's eye and that the prey that he's feeding on is included in the photo. Pearl Spotted Owl got 13, it is a certificate of merit for a 5 star worker, well done Himan Meyer. This photo has immediate impact. I like the backlighting that was used and despite that, 
that there's still so much detail visible in the pearl spotted owl's face and body. The composition works well. Well done, Himan. Line Cups got 11. It's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done, Johan Meiberg. It is a nice sighting that was captured well in the golden light. It doesn't bother me that the cups are in the road, as this is where you will find them in the game parks where they are roaming freely. The focus on the cup in front is not 100%, and watch out for the grey section behind the cup in front's right back leg. Juvenile Battelier got 10. It is gold for a 4 star worker. Well done, Arthur Eastman. Good action was captured, and the focus is good. You handled the saturation well. The photo feels a bit bright, and you can crop off some of the dead space on the left. Guinea fowl got 12. It's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done, Tom Farmer. It is a beautiful and impactful photo of the guinea fowl with good focus, light, and saturation. The dark background makes the birds stand out well. Battle got 12. It's gold for a 5 star worker. Well done, Rian Swanepoel. This photo has a lot of impact. I like the composition, the open mouth of the one swallow and the second one that's coming in to land, and it's a strong story that was captured. The photo is just a little bit bright. Mushrooms got 12. It's gold for a one star worker. Well done, Gerard Lowe. Well seen, and I like the composition of the three mushrooms. You handled the light well, and there's a lot of detail captured in the photo, giving it impact. European Roller got 10. It is silver for a 5 star worker. I like the composition, and the focus is good. The photo was just taken from a very low angle, and the shadows are very dark. This photo called Pearl Spotted Owl by Himan Meyer was chosen as best in section for the Color Nature section. Well done, Himan.